for you guys. I hope all of you are fine. Today we are going to connect uh, two computer networks with one router. First of all, I take router, and uh, after that, I use PCs, two PCs, okay? After this, for connection between PC and router, we use automatic option. Uh, it said automatically the wire type, which wire type is connected to uh, router. So after that, the first work we do that is, now you can see here, there is no IP addresses. So first of all, we assign IP address for first internet, click here after that. 192 suppose I 168 1.1 okay now we first we assign uh, our IP address for PC0 after that we set the IP address for PC1 192.168.2.1 because it's a second PC so I suppose this one. So yeah, now you can see we assign the IP addresses after assigning IP addresses. With the next step is that we uh, assign the default gateways. So for default gateways, uh, one thing to be noted: 192.168.1.3 or 1.2 you can set 1.2 and one thing you can note here that we the address of ip address is 192.168.1.1 so we write if in default gateway from here to here okay this point to be noted after that we can change the, the number because we cannot assign the same thing to default gateway so we change last digit two okay now we set uh pc1 to default gateway we check the ip address that is 192.168.2.1 so we click here 192.168.2.2 now we change the number three okay okay now you we uh, do our second step after doing second step one thing and that we go on the router and now you can see uh, one thing that is to be noted that we can see there is f a zero f a zero slash zero so we write in f as internet zero slash zero in this one, we can write the default gateway of PC0, 192.168.1.2. I think 1.2 is the default gateway. Same as a default gateway of PC0, 192.168.1.2. OK, it's right. Now we uh, select this one, 192.168.2.3. Write the same do the same thing with file and now we select fast internet zero slash one y because now whenever whenever we click here it tell us oh sorry when we click here when we drag our arrow here uh, it will show the my this time whatever i don't know okay let's write uh, default gateway of pc1 same here in router zero okay in router so click here and one thing to be noted there is uh, on the on this one okay on this option okay now they are change their colors into the uh, green so it means they are connected now now we have two paths from PC0 to router and PC1 to fast, uh, the router. There are two paths. So uh, for this, for connection, we give route uh, paths for both sides. Okay. So we give 192.168.2.1. I, I give 2.0 for this path. Okay. 
and one one ninety two or one sixty eight dot one dot zero. Sorry, I give this path for fast internet zero, PC zero to router and I give one ninety two dot one sixty eight two dot zero for PC one to router. How I know that uh, 192.168.1.0 is for this one because we said the uh, default gateway from you can notice here 192.168.1.2 so we use this path from from this to this and we can check the last digit now we can check uh, is it working or not okay it's failed um we can check what's the problem okay first of all we check uh, this one 192 1.1 okay it's correct and uh the for 1.2 it's also correct uh, so so we okay one thing we check from here to here the connection is successfully okay there is no problem from here from pc0 to router one now we Click here 192.168.2.3 192.168.2.1 Okay, 2.1 and 2.3 So 2.3 Okay, 2.3 2.3 Okay, that's is correct And we check 1.2 There is also same as a gateway of this one so now we again check from pc1 to pc router okay it's also successful but it's not working from pc0 to pc okay it's working i think we face some problems because uh, whenever you do rapidly uh, so at that time problem you have to face so guys we can do uh, our work so i hope you can understand very easily so thank you so much bye bye take care we are going to connect uh, two computer networks with one router first of all i take router and uh, after that i use pcs two pcs okay after that for connection between pc and router we use automatic option uh, it said automatically the wire type which wire type is connected with a uh, router so after that the first work we do that is now you can see here there is no ip addresses so first of all we assign ip address for fast internet click here after the 192 suppose i 168.1.1 okay now we first we assign uh ip address for pc0 after that we set the ip address for pc1 192.168.2.1 because it's a second pc so i suppose this one so uh, now you can see we assign the ip addresses after assigning ip addresses with the next step is that we assign the default gateways so for default gateways uh, one thing to be noted 192.168.1.3 or 1.2 you can set 1.2 and one thing you can note here that we the address of ip address is 192.168.1.1 so we write uh, in default gateway from
from here to here okay this point to be noted after that we can change the, the number because we cannot assign the same thing to default gateway so we change last digit two okay now we said uh pc1 to default gateway we check the ip address that is 192.168.2.1 so we click here 192.168.2.2 now we change the number three okay okay now you we uh, do our second step after doing second step one thing and uh, that we go on the router and now you can see uh, one thing that is to be noted that we can see there is f a zero f a zero slash zero so we write in f pass internet zero slash zero in this one we can write the default gateway of pc0 192.168.1.2 i think 1.2 is the default gateway same as a default gateway of pc0 192.168.1.2 okay that's right now we select like this one 192.168.2.3 write the same do the same thing with but and now we select fast internet zero slash one y because now whenever whenever we click here it tell us oh sorry when we click here when we drag our arrow here uh, it will show the my this time whatever i don't know okay let's right uh, default gateway of pc1 same here in router zero okay in router so click here and one thing to be noted there is uh, on the on this one okay on this option okay now they are change their colors into the uh, green so it means they are connected now now we have two paths from pc0 to router and pc1 to fast uh, the router there are two paths so uh, for this for connection we give route uh, paths for both sides okay so we give 192.168.2.1 i i give 2.0 for this part okay and one one ninety two dollar one sixty eight dot one dot zero sorry i give this path for fast internet zero, pc zero to router and i give one ninety two dot one sixty eight two dot zero for pc one to router how i know that one ninety two dot one sixty eight dot one dot zero is for this one because we said the uh, uh default gateway from you can notice here 192.168.1.2 so we use this path from from this to this and we can check the last digit now we can check uh, is it working or not okay it's failed um we can check what's the problem okay first of all we check uh, this one 192.168.1.1 okay it's correct and uh, default 1.2 it's also correct uh, so so we okay one thing we check then from here to here the connection is successfully okay there is no problem from here from pc0 to router one now we Click here 192.168.2.3 192.168.2.1 okay 2.1 and 2.3 so 2.3 okay 2.3 2.3 okay that is correct and we check 1.2 there is also same as a gateway of this one so now we again check from pc1 
two PC uh, router. Okay, it's also successful, but it's not working from PC zero to PC. Okay, it's working. I think we face some problems because uh, whenever you do rapidly, uh, so at that time, few problem you have to face. So guys, we can do uh, our work. So I hope you can understand very easily. So thank you so much. Bye-bye. Take care.